All right, everybody. Well, I'm back. Took a while. Had to wait for the damn weather to cool or warm up. And uh, anyway, where I left you last time is uh, I have the body all sanded down. Uh, I got the bridge fixed. It's all good. And uh, next, I'm going to be uh, sanding down the neck. Uh, one thing that came off wrong with the paint, of course, is I didn't paint them at the same time. So this one came out a lot darker. And uh, then there's some clear coat problems on the back side and stuff like that. So I'm going to take that back down to uh, complete back to wood again. And uh, I'll be back. All right. Well, the headstock's all uh, back to wood. I got the, the front, the sides, and the, and the back. It's all back to uh, back to a better state. So all I got to do now is just basically sand the uh, the, the neck down to uh, down to wood, and uh, then it'll be ready for some uh, some finer sanding, and that will also go on with the uh, the body as well. So uh, I'll be back. All right. Well, it's back to uh, back to wood. It uh, it came out pretty good, right? I mean, you can't really screw it up. I guess I could, but and then uh, yeah, so that's all done. I'm going to uh, take a little motivational break, and uh, I'll be back. All right. Well, I got uh, just got done finishing the. Uh, the sanding at uh, 150 grit on the neck. Uh, you know, I just kind of sanded it. It went down pretty good. Uh, one thing I did do a little differently. Let's see if I can zoom in and show you. If this thing will uh, focus. But uh, right in here, I kind of made a more of a, a smooth taper feel. And then same back here at the heel. I kind of uh, smoothed out this a little bit. Uh, still keeping the level where it's supposed to be, but making the transition uh, a little smoother from from the neck to uh, to the body. I think it's going to make it uh, pretty nice. So uh, I got a little more sanding to do on this. I'm going to stop at 350 on this, and then uh, go work on the body. So uh, I'll be back. Right on. So the neck has uh, all been sanded down to 320, uh, all the way uh, the front, the back, the sides, you know. Uh, I did uh, finish up doing a little bit of that. Uh, see if I can get this thing to zoom in. There you go. Can't really see it though. There's like a, let's see, let me put this down. And maybe not drop it on the floor and have to re-sand it all. Yeah, let's just go over here. That's probably a better idea. So, right here, I kind of brought this edge in, the back of the headstock, the way the curve comes in. I brought that in a little bit more and uh, tapered it up, rounded these edges off a little bit, so it's just going to be really comfortable. And then uh, going back here, most of the, uh, the bolt-on necks just have a really blocky neck stock, and so uh, I just kind of just, well, just finish this off nice and smooth like yeah it's gonna be nice so this thing's all sanded so I'm done playing with the neck got to do a little, do a little more sanding on the uh, on the body but there's uh, another issue that I forgot let me uh, zoom this out and I'll show you right there oh jeez right there so you can see the break in the binding um, so that's what I've got to figure out how to repair without like ripping off a whole bunch of binding and re-gluing it all on there. Uh, this was damaged before too where it had hit the ground and I've uh, straightened that edge up and everything's cool there. I just got to figure out how to fill in this uh, little missing link here. So I'm going to do a little research and see what i got to do on that before I spend a whole bunch of time, uh, you know, wasting my time. 
So I guess that's it for, uh, I guess for right now. Uh, well, you know, yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't really have anything else to do. So I'm going to uh, go figure out how to fix some binding. And uh, maybe I'll come back today. Maybe it'll be tomorrow. Thanks again for checking this out. I'm out of here.